Jason. No, 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 no. I sound too much. Jeannie Seeley is there with the Grand Ole Opry, if y'all have been there. She was on this week, and she is my best friend and my neighbor. Well, she and I both talk a lot, except she can sing and I can. Anyway. I don't know if you've ever tried to dance with one of those before. <laughs> it ain't easy, man. Now, uh, I don't see Phillips here. <laughs> no, I get some of it. I lived here my whole life, and it's taken me until right now to really get what this man's saying. But you'll get the gist of it. It's good. Even y'all that are from here, man, you're not going to really get this either. Here it is. Oh, yes, I got people's old Phillips. Let's bring the hottest cotton picking thing to cut the real hot glue. Coming through WHBQ in Hotel Chisco. On the magazine floor, right there, right there. That's right, why you call Sam, pardon me? No, I gotta call Sam, dude. Hi, no, ah, Pete Pick. Hi. Hey, come on, there, Earn. Pinch the Earn. Hey, little buddy. Pretty good, pardon me. Uh, get you a wheel bar load of mad dogs. Run them through the front door and tell them, fill up, sent you from me. Hot and blue. Well, then, you know, I got a new song we're gonna play here. They're gonna cut loose this new, cut loose this new song. <laughs> more times in a row, back to back. This show was only three hours long, and that particular evening, That's All Right Mama was the entire Red Hot and Blue program. Sam Phillips said, that is good enough for me, man. Signed Elvis to a three-year contract. There they are pictured together. But Elvis only stayed for about half of that time before Sam Phillips sold Elvis's contract for $35,000. You may be thinking there's not enough zeros at the end of that number. Elvis went on to sell over a billion records in the band, and they wanted some percussion on the track, so they got Johnny Cash to weave a piece of paper through the neck of his guitar like this. Makes your guitar sound like total garbage. Mm -hmm. And you move it up like this and choke the strings, it sounds percussive. And if you don't have a drummer, that's as good as it's going to get. I think we're getting somewhere, y'all. Here it is. Walk the line. And I would just like to say, if there was ever a chance for a photo opportunity on the tour. <laughs> <laughs> Keep my 